Welcome to Business Etiquette for Job Seekers and Promotion Seekers. I'm so happy to have you here. My name is Kimberly Law. I'm a certified image and etiquette expert with Personal Impact International, where I've been training companies and men and women on the topics of business etiquette since 1999. I've been featured as an etiquette expert through the media across Canada, the US, and most recently China. I've been a certified image professional through the Association of Image Consultants International since 2003, and I'm also a founding director for the Institute of Image Training and Testing International, where we advocate global business etiquette standardization. And I'm a contributing author of two books and author of several ebooks, including the complete ET certification study guides. You're probably here because you're looking for a job, working towards advancement, or are a new immigrant to North America and want to feel more confident when interacting with others from Western cultures. Whatever it is, I'm here to help. Today, I will give you some key strategies for presenting yourself confidently at a job interview or when interacting with others inside or outside of the office. My goal in creating this course was to make it easy for anyone to feel more confident interacting in the business arena and also to make it easy to learn the business behavior component of business etiquette for those of you who are planning to sit for the ET Level 1 certification exam. So let's review what you're going to learn. We're going to start off by talking about the effects of defective behavior. Then we're going to talk about the role of business etiquette and how it can affect your ability to get a job, retain a job, and move up the corporate ladder. In section two, we're going to cover strategies for networking at business mixers and how to interact professionally. We're going to identify the tools you need to be successful, how to behave, and how to schmooze with confidence to make your best impression every time. In the next section, we're going to cover greetings and handshakes. In this section, we're going to break down the three steps to a great personal introduction in a business setting. In this section, we'll identify what good eye contact really means. Then we'll discover the how-tos of a professional greeting so you can introduce yourself with confidence. And finally, we'll talk about the do's and taboos of a professional handshake. With these three steps, you can master your introduction and maximize your sphere of influence in any business setting. The fourth section is all about how to win the respect of clients and colleagues in a formal workspace. I will show you how to display a winning attitude to increase your likability, then we'll discover and demonstrate the art of introductions, and then finally, the do's and don'ts of a business meeting. In the next section, we're going to be talking about the newest etiquette, techno etiquette. Techno etiquette includes all forms of communication through technology. In this section, I will share with you phone etiquette, email etiquette, and smartphone etiquette for a great impression and effective communication in the office and on the road. In section six, we're going to talk about body language. Body language is what your body says when you're not talking. In this section, we'll identify common pitfalls. By avoiding these mistakes, you will appear more confident and communicate your message more effectively. The last section is on acing the job interview. In this section, we'll wrap up what we learned and we'll summarize how to apply these skills to stand out from the competition.